Alright, hey guys, and welcome back to DMC3, and it's time for part 7. <laughs> Honestly, I thought you were gonna forget. <laughs> next next time, next time I'm just gonna count. <laughs> and next, this time I'm not gonna miss it. Let's see how long well, I can keep this up for. Move. Well, this is my kind of rain. No wonder this Raining women. So funny today. Let me go! Let you go? <laughs> but it would be a waste if you ended up as just a pretty stain. <laughs> Am I the only one who's getting like a porno voice out of Dan yeah. uh, Dante as he says that? <laughs> well, he, he's got a really smooth, he's got like a really smooth voice in this game. One could even say he could be a smooth criminal. <laughs> Dante, not Michael Jackson. <laughs> no, okay, now I need to see Dante actually do the, uh, do the moonwalk while he shoots it. Oh, shoots demons. <laughs> hey, I would love that if they ever made it to the DMC. I'd love. Question: that. Why did she shoot him in the like face? That. Um, you can't shoot him in the dick, I mean. But, but why? Well, he kind of survived two shots. Well, if you're aiming to kill someone, No, I mean, someone, like, why did she shoot him in the shoot? first place? Oh, Because she okay, thinks well, he might be a demon, maybe. Okay, 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 Ian, think about it. Headshot equals one at KO. No, it's like, well, the, I, it's like I, the old I witch test back she in the, shot like, in medieval the face, times. But, like, the reason why she shot him in the face, but... Why did she shoot him in the face? Cause, oh, well. um, she wants to see if it, he's a demon. Like, I think the best analogy would be like, the old witch tests back in like, the medieval times, where if you die, you're not a witch. But if you live, okay, you're so a witch. Okay, so if I shoot him in, I shoot him in the fuck? face, he's so. a demon, then I'm okay. But, if I shoot him in the face, he's not a demon, then I'm dead. Okay. Yeah, that was kind of a lose-lose situation there, because if he really, if, if he wasn't a demon, and he dropped it, she didn't realize, and she didn't have time to grab that pole, she would've died. <laughs> so what I'm doing here, like, this mission pretty much is, you gotta stay uh, in the air for 20 seconds. And what I'm doing is, like, I'm jumping on these enemies, and doing something called jump cancelling to pretty much stay in the air. Or they cancel your downward momentum. No, it cancels your movements, and resets all your moves. So, like, let's say you jump, double jump, right? But mm -hmm. by jumping on an enemy's head, right, you can, or jumping in an enemy's hitbox, you can get all your, your second jump back. And it's oh, okay. pretty much the key to staying in the air for long periods of time in the Devil May Cry games. Whee. And now we're going all the way to act down. <laughs> I love doing that in games, assuming you don't take damage. Well, you don't take fall damage. You know, I do it. E I do it in the 3D Zelda games, even though I do take damage from it. I just do it anyway. <laughs> I don't know. In in order of time, Link has like these. Violent reactions to it too, but not violent. But like his reaction, like as if it, like his balls cracked in half or something. I. Wow. All right. <laughs> it it would make you wonder how would the rock feather work in like what do you call it? A uh, 3D Zelda game. The rock feather. Yeah. Well, it's basically a jump button. <laughs> yeah, but like there's fall damage, so. Well, it's not like Link's incapable of jumping in 3D Zelda games. Yeah. He, has to be, he, has to be, he has to have enough momentum to, to actually detect a jump. I wonder if Zelda Wii U is going to change that. I doubt it, but... Didn't they have one I in, uh, I in, in, in Hyrule Wii. Warriors? Yeah, but that's, uh, no. that's a that's a Musou game, not really... Actually, no, no, there's no jump button in Sometime, Hyrule Warriors. So, there was a dodge button, though. Sometimes I wonder if uh, Zelda Wii U will even happen. Oh, well, it's, it's oh, going no, to happen. That's gonna happen. It's just gonna it's, go on it, the NX too. Yeah, it's just iffy because the N they're currently developing the NX, so obviously they're debating whether they should put on the Wii or the NX. No, I'm it, I'm, I'm I'm going to say oh, it's most shit. likely go, it's most likely like 99% chance it's gonna go on Wii U, but there's most likely 100% chance it's gonna get Twilight Princess and go on the and the NX as well as the launch title, which I am perfectly okay with. So I I, I didn't redo anything. I, I did that perfectly fine. <clears throat> Okay. <laughs> sure. Did, whatever. Little did you know. Little did you know that he actually cut out twenty attempts. <laughs> <laughs> he just had masterful editing. <laughs> okay. This this I hate because like Dante's like jumps aren't made for platforming, right? But now you gotta get on top of this like window sills, like ledges, and you gotta like get that blue orb shard. So well, yeah. The, the don't don't you love when either. there's platforming in games yeah. that don't that are platformers? Well, to be fair, this is optional. At least it's not to help make from a Cry 1 style. <laughs> Seriously, 12 days later? <laughs> 12 seconds later. <laughs> <laughs> 
I, uh, oh, no, I, God damn I was going to say, <laughs> are you going to get this anytime soon? <laughs> I will. I, one day I'll get it. Or, yeah, I get it now. There you go. <laughs> kind of, you're kind of funny. You just clipped through the ground and clipped through the thing and fell down. <laughs> no, it's a mirage. It wasn't there to begin with. Just like Ghost and Goblins. Just a dream. And now we have chess pieces. Yeah. These are new enemy types. So, like, this Wait, is one the cool type of enemy. Because, like, there's... Like, these guys are pawns, right? But you also see, like, knights and queens and, like, rooks and stuff. And they all have different moves and stuff. So it's really cool. Yeah, that's a nice touch to add. And they kind of remind me of those enemies from Zelda. Those three Zelda. Oh, yeah, They're like the, the hopping statues. Yeah. From which one? From which game? From the 3D Zelda games, like Ocarina of Majora's Mask, etc. Oh, I mean Armos. Oh, I mean the, ho oh, yeah, mean. the, hop the hopping statues. Oh, you mean Armos? Yeah. It's a good. It's a good thing. It's a good thing. Uh, Dante's sword is strong enough to cut through rock. Yeah. I don't know if I've mentioned this already, but like the swords in DMC have like ridiculous feats and stuff. So like Dante's rebellion is supposed to be unbreakable, and like. Virgil's Yamato is supposed to be able to cut through time and space and stuff. It's really crazy. Okay, so it's strong enough to get to cut through time and space, but it can shatter. But it can shatter like a piece of glass. No, Yamato can't. Well, oh, okay, well, so that's also. Mm, I know what I'm doing yeah. on, on my Tuesday like nights. Shatter yep. the sword. <laughs> uh, it's kind of funny how in some animes they say how a sword is indestructible, but then somebody finds a way to break it. Yeah. And, you know, it's like in some animes, like they pretty much take all the like super swords, like the Infinity Plus One style swords, are like always katanas for some reason. Hey, katanas are badass. Exactly, katanas are cool. Hey, I like my and great swords too. Let me guess, this uh, these enemies have the ability to spawn more mooks. Yeah, thankfully they don't spawn anyone too strong. So, yeah. Plus, the enemies in DMC three aren't like so tough compared to DMC ones. Well, they're they're, they're basically cannon fodder for you to combo them. <laughs> yeah, except until you get to the non like comboable enemies, which are just a pain in the ass. No, wait, non comboable enemies like what are they? A super armor? You'll see when we get when like when when I get to them. But there are a few. Well, there's one in particular which I hate fighting, but I can't tell you now. Maybe not today. Maybe not tomorrow. But soon and for the rest of the yeah. Days. Trust in the Ramon that doesn't trust in you. Yeah, I believe in the heart of the card, too. <laughs> and yeah, they're holding coffins. I forget what they're called, though. They kind of yeah. look like more like urns than coffins, but... Ah, that statue is boobs. Well, so are yeah, all, like, modern Greek art. Riveting commentary. Thanks for... Thanks for... Uh... Thanks for getting rid of all those enemies here. Did that just say it was Shrek's chic? No, no. Siren's, um, Siren's chic. It was Shrek's, Shrek's chic. Shrek and chic had a child. Please, for the love of God, don't. Yeah, just don't, don't. I don't want to think about this. Please don't. It's the fan, it's the fan fiction that you need to know. I, I, I don't actually. The only I, I don't. I don't know what Dun, uh, dungeons you're you're watching, but <laughs> you're reading. I mean, the only fan fiction I need to know is suddenly Vegeta. That's all I need to know. <laughs> That's the only real fan fiction there ever is. That's a top tier fan fiction. That's the only one you ever should read. Actually, no. That's Suddenly. canon. <laughs> Yeah, when the Naruto and Dragon Ball Z crossover that eventually happens, is that's gonna happen somewhere. <laughs> suddenly, Vegeta. Now, even if it doesn't even involve Dragon Ball, suddenly Vegeta always happens. Yeah, uh, somewhere in the future, we're gonna have we're gonna have a, a commentary where we just edit in suddenly Vegeta at some point in our lives. <laughs> I don't know who's gonna do it, but someone is going to do it. Probably, probably me. All right, so that yeah, thing I just you. blew up was pretty much you gotta get certain style rank in order to break it. That one you gotta get S rank and like in DMC three they're kind of finicky because you have to only use certain weapons. So if it's red you only gotta use like rebellion and if it's like um orange you gotta use Agni and Rudra. If it's blue you gotta use Cerberus, stuff like that. In DMC four they're a lot like more lenient because you can use all weapons. Ow, ow, so hot. Ah. I was gonna say are he you doing me. that but is he doing that? 
No, I'm doing that. It's, it's one of the oh, things because in like DMC three you can like move sort of in like in engine cutscenes like that. Ah, uh, so like every first person game that uses in engine cutscenes where you could walk like fifty miles away and still hear them talking. Yeah. <laughs> or you can just put a bucket on their head while they're talking. Or you could shoot them. Yeah, but where's I the like fun in that? People. Hey, it's tons of it's tons of fun to kill friendly marine units in Halo and then watch them decimate you in like one shot. Yeah, I, I never, I never like, like, I, I never understood that because like, their weapons are way stronger than yours. How come they're getting like owned by the Covenant? <laughs> because well, they're they not do, the chief. They do have infinite ammo. <laughs> yeah, but they do way more damage than you do. Uh, Marines suck. <laughs> That's all you need to know. Marines suck. Well, that is until, like, they get betrayed. Yeah, and then suddenly, like, the also, weapons are, like, Also, never, <laughs> suddenly never shoot the Captain Keys. Anybody who says anything about this, shut up. <laughs> about what? I know someone's you, gonna you, say you, it. You, you all know. No, she... <laughs> I think I know, but I don't think I actually know. I, so. I'm just happy to be here. No, th well, we're gonna have more chances to bring it up later on. No. You, you mean to not no. bring it up, or you mean to not bring no. it up, right? <laughs> I was gonna say you mean to not bring it up. <laughs> I like how I like how you were able to get like pot shots off the enemies like no, that. No, that didn't hurt them though. Even 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 if they were invincible, they're like, hey, you dick, we just got here. It's a meme, you dip. Memes aren't the only thing that exists in the world, Ian. Are you sure about that? Well, contrary to what 12-year-old kids tell you, yes. Ow. The hell? Was that ragdoll physics? No, 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 yeah. Some some attacks will just knock you backwards. Then the way he's just rolling along the ground just now. Hey, Dante. Dante's got to look stylish at all times, even <laughs> when he gets knocked down. <laughs> you, and for God's sakes, he, gets, he looks stylish when he gets stabbed through the chest. He fit right into he fit right into the platoon. He'd be the most he'd be like the freshest uh, squid on the block. Hey, you guys have to admit, even when I'm even when I'm dead, I still look good. <laughs> and then ten minutes later, his body starts decaying. Still got it. <laughs> <laughs> he still has the white hair. <laughs> you know, I guess that's one of the benefits of having white hair. Nobody can ever tell you, nobody can ever tell you that you're getting gray hair because you already had white hair from birth. <laughs> You'll never look old. But then will we ever actually be young? Shut up. <laughs> yeah, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> well, you just die already. Nah, it's not, it's not my designated death time. Okay, now it is. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder what's going on. I wonder what Virgil's doing right now. Oh, you're gonna see. He's just like waiting He's up there, smoking weed. No, he... yeah, <laughs> you know, just chilling, chilling with uh, Arkham. Just Netflix and chill. Yeah. <laughs> I can imagine him sitting, like sitting at a table, like drinking some tea, like so. You have no idea how, how much I want, I want Netflix and chill with like my girlfriend. That then do it. <laughs> well, you with see, Dante. she lives two hours away. You can still do it, just Skype, put on Netflix, and chill. There you go. <laughs> and you have a car now, don't you? Yeah. So use it. So then do it. I mentioned <laughs> yes, she's, do it. she's like two and a half hours away. So? Yeah, so just do it. <laughs> Sh shut up, Shia LaBeouf. <laughs> I wasn't even trying to go for that. <laughs> yeah, it's oh, fine, yeah. you can just sit there and take it all day. <laughs> It just like he's just being a bit inconvenienced. <laughs> <laughs> it's like getting that's like walking down the street getting shot and you just look down your body. It's full of bullet holes. Eh, oh well. This isn't anything. <laughs> it's like oh well. <laughs> I'm gonna go and get it. It happens I'm sometimes, just, you know. I'm just gonna respawn anyway. <laughs> now you're just you're walking down the street. Your arm just suddenly falls off, blood is gushing everywhere. This police is like, excuse me, sir, you realize you're bleeding out. It's like, ah, oh, it's just one of those days, so you know how it, it is. It, <laughs> it's just a flush wound. <laughs> for you, it was um, the most important day of your life, but for Bison, it was just Tuesday. Don't worry, I still got one hit point left. So yeah, these guys, That's remember a... these guys were like the boss of the second mission? 
Yeah, now they're regular enemies. Yeah. Which again, I like it when games do that. It shows the pro um, a progression of strength. Come on, Armand. He was already dead. You didn't have to taunt him. I'm just saying. Hey, that's that's the best part of time. Like, no, I thought the uh, best time to taunt them was when they were still alive. So we so I need to wear a striped so sweater. Is hey man, I'm too poor to pay respect. You, you gotta, you gotta understand something, though, Slendy. You can't teabag anyone in this game, so that's the only thing you can do is taunt the corpse. You can, you can semi teabag and you can jump up and down where they died. It's better than nothing. Nah, I'd rather taunt the corpse. You'd be terrible at funerals. <laughs> See Dante just do a dance on top of the coffin. <laughs> Dante would do that. <laughs> Put on some jazz when you're like saying a eulogy. Hey, that, oh, that's crazy. what the New Orleans people do. How would you know? Dance on people's coffins? No, play jazz. During funerals? No. Well, like afterwards, yeah. <laughs> Sounds legit, and jazz goes with everything, after all. I thought that was golf's theme. Well, video game-wise, yes. It's a castle! Well, it's not really a castle, it's a tower. It's a place. castle! It's a tower. It's a- <laughs> The two separate things. It's a castle tower. Hold on, Virgil. Nah, I'm now coming. You're just being crazy. Now you're just being crazy. No, hang on. I can see a nice view from here. Okay, now I'm here. Oh man, you can't believe how many steps I had to walk. <laughs> Seriously, did you guys never know? You guys never thought of inventing an elevator in here? The hell is an elevator? You showed up. Yeah, thanks. Well, you know, I was just passing by the area, you know, I thought, man, I want to fuck with Virgil today. Just give it a <laughs> shot. <laughs> I feel like being a troll today. Oh, bullshit, you're just a cheap ass. <laughs> Anyone else feel like this the voice acting is subpar? No, it's better than DMC DMC. Yeah, it's better than DMC 1's. Well, everything's pretty much better than DMC 1. Nah, I think the voices fit the characters. Yeah, especially Virgil's. Well, yeah, Virgil's supposed to be, like, monotone -ish. I never really found, the only thing is that I don't think, I never really found, uh, voice acting, I don't think voice acting was really a thing until, like, PS3, Xbox 360. Well, no, yeah. it, was, it was around during, it was around even during PS1 days, it was no, just oh, more oh, common yes, as... That's what I'm saying, I mean, like, I don't think it was really more, um, like, it didn't really matter as much until, like, until around that time. Yeah, until they start bringing, like, in Hollywood voice actors and stuff. Which is, again, it's a giant waste of money in my eyes, but whatever. Yeah. So, like, I, I really, well, I don't know I why, think, but I'm really the, bad in this boss fight. I think, like, when I did the really, test recording, I did this no damage, but now I keep taking so much damage for this, I don't know why. <laughs> Bird is like, hmm, hmm, that wasn't good, let me try it again. Yeah, so, Lindy, to go on what you were saying about the, uh, of, like, Hollywood voice actors, they, they pretty much do that so that they can get, like, more publicity and, you know, act, bigger names sell more copies. Yeah, but it's, oh. it's it's just so weird to me because you're paying so much money just for a voice yeah, like actor. Yeah, like how they probably that you, paid, that you could clearly uh, you could clearly spend money on better things. Like, it's similar okay, to how like branded I, stuff works here in like North America, where really the product is pretty much the same. It's just you're paying just for you're the brand. Money, yeah, you're paying extra money for the brand, i.e., Apple. Like, yeah. Well, 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 look at it this way: What would you rather be with a Hollywood voice actor or Mega Man 8's voice actors? I'd rather Mega Man 8's voice actor if the if the if that money will be put towards better. To make the game better, I I wouldn't. I, I would say something in the middle. Like you don't have to be Mega Man Ace voice actor, but you know. No, have I'm not to be saying. Hollywood. I'm not saying. Yeah, I'm not saying go out of your way to have bad voice actors or something. We're not care at all. I'm just oh. saying better balance, better hold, budget hold on, balance on, your game. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Virtus is in a dick move. You just freaking use the hilt and just hit uh, Dante in the stomach. Yeah, I don't oh. know. I, well, would you rather he stab Dante? I I feel like I don't know. But it, does, it does sell though. Like how they brought uh I completely forget his name and I really feel bad for it, but uh the one voice actor that they brought in for ODST. 
Oh, um, Nathan yeah. Fillon? Yeah, and he played Buck. And he's back in Halo 5. Or like, uh... <laughs> or, how, or like how they brought Peter Dinklage into Destiny. Uh, uh Peter Dinklage Don, Don, is, Don, um, Tyrion Lannister, Don, right? Don, yeah. Like, Dante just now. It's like, I'm, it's like, it's like, father? I don't care about father. I just don't like you. <laughs> Hey, that's probably the reason I would do this, too. Ow, I was stabbed. Oh, this is nothing. I've been stabbed many times. I got. I even got stabbed with my own sword. Twice. I'm feeling lucky today. Want to go for three? <laughs> hey, that's my locket. Give it back. I guess I'm gonna have to take it from you. Face. <laughs> Face. Now I'm gonna take your sword too. And he took a sword. Bastard. <laughs> Bastard. You took my you took my lock and now my sword. Damn it, not again. Okay, you can have it back now. <laughs> I told I told you I was feeling lucky going for three on my sword. I bet Arkham thinking man, that looks worse than my face. So Arkham just looks at he's like better than me. What the? I really meant it when I when I I really meant it when I wanted my lock back. Now give it back! <laughs> How does that not completely fuck up his hand? Cause, uh, he's a demon, and he has regen. You know, there's a- You know, a lot, a lot of the reasons why these kids are able to survive so I bullshit want and so my bullshit locket. attacks- The reason why so many kids are able to survive so much bullshit attacks like those is because they have a healing factor. Yeah. Pretty much Dante is Wolverine, basically. Unless you cut nah. off his head, he's not dead. No, nah, they got Call of Duty health regen. Only different, only difference is uh, Dante can survive a blade to the body where an average Call of Duty player cannot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, get a knife in the back and someone hit KO. No, get a knife to the foot and then someone hit KO. <laughs> yeah, it's it's not even <laughs> like cute. a stab. It's just like, oh, I'm gonna move this nice knife in front of you, and if you're in my way, you're dead. So is Achille Achilles heel. I guess you could say that. Achilles' body. Uh, yeah, Achilles' body, because it applies to the rest of the body, too. Not just the heel. Being body. Ah. <laughs> it's like, it's like as you're facing one, like, a giant, like, like a, a huge, like, all right, beef down uh, guy, and all you did was stab his foot, and it's like... Next time on Cross Factor Comms. Oh! Only an A rank.